That music goes straight to my heart. It does? Uh, yes, and it's not doing my stomach any good either. Uh, what exactly is that tune you're playing? Well, it's called, uh, Why are you the one who took the blooms and left me an empty vase? Shouldn't that be Vaz? Okay, Vaz, you're the one that took the blues and left me an empty vase. Uh, do you mind if we start this conversation again? No, I don't mind. Uh, hello. Oh, how are you? Oh, same as yesterday. Oh, how were you yesterday? I'm gonna remember that far back. Hey, you like a good music. Yes, but don't let that stop you. Go right ahead and play. Hey, you live around here? Ah, uh, no, I came all the way from Moscow. Have a rough trip? Ah, uh, no, thanks. I just had one. <laughs> Ah, uh, tell me, uh, you work here? No, I don't work here. Uh, but the brother of my mama's other son, he does. The brother of your mother's other son. That's you. Hey, then I must have worked here. <laughs> uh, tell me, has anyone in your family ever committed suicide? I'm a not thinker, so. Well, why don't you go down to the Volga and break the monotony? <laughs> well, I think about it. By the way, uh, what do you call yourself? I'm a not calling myself. I'm always someplace near. <laughs> no, no, you don't understand. You see, in my own futile way, I'm just trying to find out your name. Oh, my name. She's a Carlo Luigi Biondello Bonanova the Mozzarella. Uh, how do you spell that? Wrong every time. <laughs> hey, I'm a no come from Russia. I was born in Italy. Oh, why'd you leave Italy? Because I know kind of bring it to with me. <laughs> <laughs> That's a funny joke, no? You just answered your own question. Hey, what's your name? My name is Serge B. Samovar. My father called me Serge. Uh, what he really wanted was a new blue suit. Oh, well, uh, what do you do for a living? You know, I thought you'd never ask. Uh, here, you think you can play this? You betcha my life. Well, then I can best introduce myself by singing the song that made me famous. And folks, I hope it makes you famous too. <laughs> I'm Russia's leading legal brain. I'm wise to all the loopholes. And very modestly, I maintain I haven't any scruples. Let's not forget my father, a liar too was he. In fact, he shouted, I object! The first time he saw me, I'm Samovar, the bore of the bar, a most obnoxious liar. I'll press your lawsuit while you wait. And scorch it too, I know I ya. I'm a sewer who knows how to sue. Ah, uh, you slander me, and that's my cue. I'll litigate all over you. I'm Sam Obama, the lawyer. Hello, lawyer. Hello, lawyer. Legal skill has everyone in awe. I've broken many a woman's will. It's more fun than the law. The first case I defended, a poor old Muscovite, got 14 years for forging checks, and he couldn't even write. Oh, but I haven't introduced myself. I'm Sam Avar, the lawyer. I once addressed the court for days in Springfield, Illinois. Yeah. On a trifling point, I wouldn't budge. I turned the jury's brains to fudge. They freed the crook and hanged the judge. Don't hire me, I'll destroy ya. So three hurrahs for Sam Avar. Hurrah, 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 hurrah. Now there sits a man with an open mind. You can feel the draft from here. I'm Sam The lawyer. Put it there. Excellent. Frank and David, uh, it, actually it's David and Frank in that order, isn't it? Yeah, sure, the other way around. D can I see a program? <laughs> oh, I, I, see what I, I see what I'm up against. I was going to ask you how you worked on this, but uh, it's going to be difficult yeah. under the circumstances. You expect the straight answer? And <laughs> well, uh, yeah, it's hard to get that, isn't it? Uh, did, 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 was rehearsal difficult for you at all? Oh, no, it was great fun. Yeah? It's the, I, 
It continues to be. I don't know how to speak, whether to be me or to be him. <laughs> it's uh, very hard. It, it's, it, I can see what you're up against, even in the dressing room. As Groucho, it's Im virtually impossible for him to s talk like a normal person. Or to stand up straight. You yeah. sort of <laughs> it's just a, it may be the microphone, but... <laughs> did you... Uh, <laughs> yeah, well, you certainly could have fooled me, eh? You see, now I'm doing it. Did you, uh, did you in fact, though, go to the films over and over and over? Uh, or did you have the... Uh, image in your head to begin with. When I, when I um, knew that I was going to play Chico, which was back in London, I yeah. went to see about um, eight Marx Brothers movies in a row to um, see how he played and get the character and all that kind of thing. And I just went to different cinemas all around at two in the morning and things like that just yeah. to see what it was like to get the character. You had seen them before, of course. I mean, I had, but I didn't have an enormous memory of them, really. You weren't a Marx Brothers um, freak, as Not they say. particularly. I've yeah. since become one, I think. Yeah. Um, because uh, the humor is so fresh now, as fresh as it was when it first came out. Absolutely. And, um, I appreciate it more now. Groucho I, could I, never quite believe that there were lines around the, the block and so on at the revivals and at the college campuses. and Never could have really absorbed that. Did you, either of you ever, by any chance, meet the people you play? No, I, I met Chico's daughter, Maxine, yeah. who came back to the dressing room on the first night and said, Daddy! <laughs> nice thing you could yeah. say. But you, you never met Groucho, though you easily could have. No. Yeah. In fact, when I was in college, uh, was the time of that renaissance of their films, yeah. with the lines around the block and in Cambridge, and uh, yeah. that's where it started. Yeah. Although I didn't really get into it in, until uh, we started work together, mm -hmm. and we have seen them all backwards, forwards, yeah. sideways, and practically yeah, sl sleep them. Yeah. Yeah. But Groucho was a friend of yours, wasn't he? Yes, I did a lot of shows with Groucho, and I, I, I just loved knowing him, and um, I, I got, I guess, maybe in some ways the last of his prime on, on tape, and uh, uh, was, it, it was wonderful. He, w he was always funny, uh, yet he was often quite serious, too. I mean, he could be funny at all times. I never saw him in, 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 a, very, in a bad mood. I remember once we were at a theater in the lobby, and a lady came up as he was talking to me and said, uh, can I tell you how much I love you? And he said, you'll have to get in line. <laughs> and, uh, so you can see he was... Thank you both for being Thank here. You. They're both quite uncanny, your performances. I commend you on them. Thank you. Thanks Thank again. You.